Well, in July 2023, India will be launching a spacecraft to land on the moon. The mission is known as Chandrayaan-3 and then it will be a spacecraft mission to study the sun from afar. It is known as Aditya L-1. On the sidelines of the ISRO's first ever international conference on spacecraft mission operations, the ISRO chief, Dr. Somnath, spoke to Vyon Siddharth MP. In coming months, as you rightly pointed out, spacecrafts are going to be the hero's uh, mission to moon, mission to Lagrangian Point 1, Aditya. So tell us about the status, how far have we come? Mission to moon is Chandrayaan-3. Uh, Chandrayaan-3 is getting ready for launch. Uh, this uh, may happen by the middle of July, if everything goes well. Satellite is already at the spaceport. Uh, rocket is in integration process. Uh, for everything is ready, by this month end, it will get integrated. And uh, our window for launch starts on 12th July and uh, only, a, only a week's window if, uh, and we have to see everything goes well at that time and subsequently the all other remaining operation will happen. Sir, and uh, when it comes to the orbiter and lander combination this time around, tell us about how you've distributed the mass differently this time. See, this time the orbiter is a propulsion module only. The propulsion part is retained in the orbiter, whereas the uh, instruments and payloads are not removed from that, not required as it is there in Chandrayaan 2 already. So we could get gain some mass out of it, which is now allocated to the lander part for strengthening the lander, including its power generation capabilities enhanced, its landing legs are strengthened, its impact capabilities improved, uh, its propulsion is made uh, more uh, tolerant to failure, so more propellant is added as such, and some instruments are newly added. So all this gave some heavy mass to the lander, so that is how we distribute the mass. So based on all the hard work of ISRO scientists, how confident are we about uh, Chandrayaan-3 this time? I'm always confident. But space is such a thing that confidence is not the only thing that will help you in the ultimately. We must make sure things work. So we do apply our testing philosophies, make sure that we don't make any hasty decisions. We do very cautiously, make use of all advisors, go through a, a, a collective decision-making process so that we don't err at any point in time. So this is very important. It's a, it's a culture that will help you ultimately. And of course, we need to have uh, uh, that the right time. We've got luck also to have the landing. But luck comes out of hard work and uh, perseverance to do the right thing at the right time.